The historic Biltmore Estate in Asheville, North Carolina, has temporarily closed after Tropical Storm Helene wreaked havoc on the surrounding region. This iconic estate, known for its grandeur and significance, faced the aftermath of intense flooding as the nearby Swannanoa River overflowed. While the estate itself, including the famous Biltmore House, sustained minimal damage, the surrounding areas were severely impacted. Biltmore Village, located near the estate's entrance, was completely submerged by floodwaters, leaving mud and debris scattered across streets and properties. Helene's devastation left parts of the 8,000-acre estate, especially low-lying areas such as the entrance and farm, vulnerable to flooding. Trees were uprooted, and the aftermath left roads impassable for days. Fortunately, despite the flooding, the Biltmore House and other key attractions like the conservatory, winery, gardens, and hotels remained largely unaffected. However, damage assessments are still underway, and it is unclear when the estate will fully reopen. Initial estimates suggest that it will remain closed until at least October 15, 2024, as cleanup efforts continue. The estate is currently focusing on recovery efforts to ensure the safety of both its staff and visitors. This closure extends to annual pass holders, wine club members, and sporting clay club members. Visitors are encouraged to monitor the estate's website for updates on refunds and cancellations, as well as the status of reopening plans. Biltmore officials expressed their gratitude for the community's patience and highlighted the efforts of first responders and volunteers who are tirelessly working to bring the region back to normal. While the main estate may be spared from severe damage, the storm has left a significant mark on the surrounding areas, underscoring the widespread impact of Helene on Asheville and Western North Carolina. Stay subscribed for more videos.